So, tonight we have um, something that I was against buying, but we have to try it. Um, God, we have another Mountain Dew product that I did not want to put into my gullet. And that's uh, a Mountain Dew Flaming Hot. Uh, I don't know how I feel about this, but I I guess I'll know soon how I feel about it, won't I, huh? So, um, what could be better than um, the liquid version of Flaming Hot Powder, right? I mean, who wouldn't want this? It says, uh, caution, Flaming Hot Taste on it. Everybody loves this. So we're gonna give this bad boy an open. All right, what does it smell like? You know what? It it smells orangey. And I'm gonna, okay, I hate that I'm about to say this. It smells good. It actually does. It smells good. It's everything that you like about the smell of Mountain Dew with a little bit of orange, actually. But it can't be right. I have to be smelling something else, but that's what it comes across as. All right, well... If it's supposed to be actually flaming hot and it's supposed to be spicy, that means we can't take a small drink. We have to take a big drink. So let's uh, let's take ourselves to a special kind of hell, huh? Oh my god! Oh god! <laughs> it's actually spicy. <laughs> Oh Lord, that's that's not enjoyable. <laughs> oh God, it's like it's really good for the first like half a second, and then it turns, and then it's not good, and it's spicy. <laughs> oh God, okay, let's take a smaller sip so we actually get the taste of it. Oh man. Oh. Yeah, um, so here's the thing about this. If you like spice for spice's sake, you might like this. Um, it doesn't taste bad, which is actually very surprising, because I thought I was 100% sure it would be, like, some kind of weird... Like, actually Cheeto flavor. I, I guess, in, in part, I almost expected cheese. But then it's 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 not what I thought, and in a good way. It's uh, better than I thought because it's terrible abomination of a product that should never have been created. Uh, didn't kill me, but we're gonna have to wash that down with our other friend. We got uh, that's right. This is a double do situation. We have uh, live wire here, which is do sparked with artificial orange flavor. And we're gonna try that too. Cause we got, like I said. So, so, I've never had live wire. I don't know. I've never had live wire. I've had code red. Oh, it smells like Fanta. Oh yeah. It smells exactly like Fanta. This is everything you want. Now this is pretty good. This is um No, this is good. This is a keeper. I would get this again. The orange flavor isn't like overpowering. It still tastes like Mountain Dew. It's just got like an extra friend coming along for the ride. Riding the live wire with you? Now this is good. I would recommend live wire. I would not recommend Mountain Dew Flaming Hot. No matter how much no matter how much you look at the can, and you see the little dude down here, and you're thinking like, that looks like a nice little gentleman. Like, look at this guy. But you're wrong. He's not a nice gentleman. He's a mean, mean man who wants to do bad, dirty things to your tongue. Which, 20 bucks is 20 bucks, but I wouldn't suggest 